Okay, I'm uh, going to be in a, I'm here at a high school and I'm talking to 11th, 12th graders on career paths outside of going to college. So, all right, thanks for having me here today. I wanted to talk to you about the profession in the union trades and why you might find that exciting and beneficial to yourself. Um, one of the things we're starting to hear about this more and more is the work-life balance. And the uh, uh, profession of the trades is, is, is great with that. There's projects you can get on with overtime and there are projects that are straight time. If, if you want to have that better work-life balance, most construction projects work Monday through Friday. They work during the daylight hours normally 6 to 2 30 7 to 3 30 you always get holidays off so you're gonna have every weekend you want every holiday you're not going to be working in the evenings when you should be out you know playing softball with your buddies or whatever you might like to do uh, the other thing that's great is um, you're working your mind and your body um, I mean look at me I don't need to <laughs> no, but I've been in the office a little too long myself. But it is. I mean, you you are going to be exercising your body. So uh, you know, if, if you don't want the physicality of that, then it probably wouldn't be a good profession for you. But if you want to stay a little bit fit and use your mind throughout the day, it's it's a great great profession for that. The last thing is, it's pretty good money and benefits. Um, Minimum wage right now, you know, in the city of Seattle is $15 an hour. Um, you know, in the trades, you're going to make $50 to $60 an hour. On top of that, unlike college, you're not spending any of your money going through an apprenticeship and all that on-job training. That's that's all free. So you're gonna you're gonna make within three to four years $100 to $120,000 a year. And you can excel beyond that, depending on your ambitions. Um, so I, you know, I've been in the trades 30 years, and I'm glad I, I made the choices that I did. So if there's any interest that you have in that, come up here and see me afterwards. I got some pamphlets to hand out and ask me any questions you'd like. Thank you for your time.